I had to get down to the street. Mona had come through here. The dead cleaner's a sign of her passage. Help! Anybody! <coughs> oh, oh, bless you. I, I owe you one. This is where the fun starts. Yeah, no sweat. You should be. The gas job. from the broken pipe was feeding the flames. Uh, I couldn't get like through. You. Yeah. <laughs> I was a cop. <laughs> Cost me my marriage. Long hours. He was terrified something would happen to me. Goddamn slime. Hey, suckers! The gas valve was in the utility room. With the gas turned off, the fire on the third floor was no longer a problem. Coward! They hit you home? It's like a friggin' kindergarten out there. What next? A kid with a bag full of guns and a head full of video games turns the house into a shooting gallery. Breaks my heart. What the hell's going on? With me, he meant. I had my doubts about the cleaners spying on me. About Mona. According to Vladimir Lem, the mob captain Vincent Gognitti, is behind the hits. Seems he's made a deal with an unknown third party. Maybe the cleaners. I don't know. Something doesn't fit. If it's true, I've been added on Gogniti's list. I came close to lying to Bravura. I told myself I needed to find out the facts first before others could screw up the evidence. But that was an excuse. Mona had gotten under my skin. I couldn't close my eyes to any of it anymore. It was more important than the job. She had tried to reach me, left her number. Risky leaving your number at the police station. Trace the call and you'll see I'm talking to you from Hong Kong. Winterson. I'll give you my address. Make sure you're not followed. 
Max, what's going on? What do you mean? Don't do anything stupid. <laughs> 